Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Happy Canada Thanksgiving weekend. We had plans to go to a different spot. Um, we are choosing our spot this weekend based on the ability of friends and family being able to come and join us for part of this adventure. We have people coming to join us for the day, especially on Sunday. Um, our youngest and her partner will be coming to join us and they just drive a car. So we needed to be able to get somewhere that was accessible for them. Our first spot was a dud and we ended up in hope at this beautiful little gem that we found and we are super excited using the hammock for the very first time. Big bonus. We hope you stick around. We are planning on doing another nostalgic meal and we hope you enjoy what we have to show you. Thanks for watching. All right. Hi. <laughs> so we are going to do a little bit of prep work. Yeah, for the nostalgic meal tonight. These things are so small, man, but all good. All good. Are we going to reveal? Well, you should, because I didn't even know what we were doing until you told me. Okay. <laughs> well. You, I didn't know what this one was going to be. I thought we were going to do the... Uh, We'll save the other one later. we talked about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we were over at our youngest's for dinner on the other night. Thursday. Thursday. Yeah. And um, we were obviously talking about nostalgic meals, and she came up with what she thought would be a good idea. Um, so background, our youngest did not like beef. No, she hated it. It was horrible. Would not eat steaks, would not eat no. roast beef. The only beef she would be eating would be... Hangaburgers. Hangaburgers. <laughs> so her nostalgic memory meal is hangaburgers. Hangaburgers. And it was anywhere from a frozen cheap patty to homemade beef patties on sometimes bread. Yep. Because that's the way it was. Yeah, like when we first met, you were I was a single dad, you were a single mom. You do what you do, right? You do what you got to do, exactly. So we are doing burgers in honor of our youngest, Miss Kalia. But, but we are elevating it. Extra lean bison. Which bison. she actually provided, actually. She Actually, yes. She gave us the bison. So our plan for this meal is... So we're going to make, well, obviously the burgers, and then we're going to add bacon and cheddar, if I recall. You should be good. It's going to be delicious. So right now we so. are going to just form the patties so they're ready to go while we have light. Yeah, so we haven't done a lot with bison, so I don't know if it needs a binder. Like, I know hamburger, we don't add anything to it, but I'm not sure about bison. So what do you think we should do? Should we go add a binder like an egg, or should we just raw dog it and let it go? Mm. While we're cooking it over the fire, do you yeah. think? I don't know. I did bring an extra egg in case we wanted to go with an egg. I think we should maybe put an egg. Okay, cool. I'll All grab right. one. Okay. Okay, so we're going to keep it simple because, well, this is the first time cooking with... Yeah. Well, cook... Oh, that came out fast. <laughs> like pepper? I like... I we, hope so. We do like pepper. Okay, why is it not... There we go. This is very, like, amateur hour for me. Yeah, so bison, I, I don't know. This is actually my first cook with bison. Um, I know Kaylee's partner, Alexander, has had bison before and he let me try a piece of it, which led us to when we were in Calgary. Remember I had that bison strip loin, I think it was? Oh, that was so good. Yeah, that was really good. But yeah, it's really like my first time doing a bison burger, so. First time cooking with it, yeah. Yeah. And I don't imagine it'll shrink much being extra so lean. So lean, yeah. I wouldn't think so. This will be... So we'll form these, we'll let them sit in the ice co to firm up and... Go from there. Go from there. And then uh, we will see you guys at the grill. It's time for... We should just call it Mountain View Brewery Review. <laughs> yeah, it seems to be. <laughs> <laughs> so as we said earlier, we are back in Hope, which means a stop at Mountain View Brewery. This one's called Spruced Up. It's not a sour, and I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit not sure of this one, but I'll read the description. It is that time of year, spruce up your taste buds with this fresh springtime ghost, G-O-S-E. 
made with plenty of locally harvested spruce tips that were hand-picked by our team. Thank you, Leona Baker. This brew is refreshingly tart and crisp with a citrus terp note, finished with a touch of sea salt and coriander. Take a sip and spruce up your day. This beer is dedicated to Adam Brody, the first to add just the tip into the Mountain View brew. <laughs> That's hilarious. Isn't that funny? <laughs> and it's in quotes. I was actually holding back my laugh. That was pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully we shall see. She said it was good. Here we go. Wow. You're I'm pretty worried surprised. about that one too, actually. I was really worried about this one. It's, you definitely get the citrus. Definitely first bang citrus. It almost has a bit of sourness to it, though, I'm going to say. Really? Mm-hmm. The back end, I think, is the spruce. And it's actually, I got to say, Mr. Our buddy Holger, Although, to be fair, it does say it has citrus in it. I was going to say, I got one with no fruit. Oh. But it does have citrus, and I definitely taste the citrus. But it's actually very refreshing. And would I buy it again? I'm not 100% sure, to be 100% honest. But you'd still be wandering around the fridges of Mountain View. I will still be wandering around <laughs> every time we have the chance. It is, uh, yeah. I, w I wouldn't say it's terrible, but it is not as good as the sours that I've had previously. Cheers. So we're going to start cooking some bacon? Well, we probably should if we're doing bacon cheddar burgers. I'll grab some bacon. See I if just I can need a little paper towel here. Find it in the ice co. Should be right on top, I think. There it is. We're just nice going to do... So how many pieces do you want, though? Well, probably, I don't know. Two or three? Two or three per burger and yeah. save the rest for breakfast. Oh, yeah. Which... No, totally for breakfast. But... Campfire bacon. Oh, yeah. This is the best. If you don't like campfire bacon, don't ever talk to me. <laughs> Having said that, we hope you go down below and hit that sub button. Okay, so our first attempt at ever cooking a Ouch. bison burger from bison ground. Hopefully this works out because it's our dinner. I would, on the outer edges. No, I think they're gonna need direct heat actually. Ooh, yeah, it's got the perfect heat. Sorry, what was that? I'm guessing I would say cheese now. Ready for I, cheese? Yeah, I think so. All right. I'm not 100% sure, but I think so. They look good. Well, I hope so. I've been trying my best. Um, Bib, how did you wrap these? Like some kind of sorcery is this. The other end. Oh, no. Yep. No. It should be, yeah. No. <laughs> Hang on, let me put the camera down for a second. Here, I'll just rip it open, because it's, it's only cheese at the end of the day. All right. So light is dying quickly. But let's get these buns dressed. That's a uh, crispy bacon. <laughs> Nothing wrong with a little crispy bacon. Can we drop some? I don't I think so. I'll find it later. <laughs> Something will find it later. <laughs> All right. So All right. we have our bacon cheddar bison burgers. 
All right, my well, dear. How is it? It's freaking amazing. A little dry. That's mine. My bad. But yeah, my God, what a flavor. What a what a burger. Nice. Are Love we... you, kiddo. Thanks for the suggestion. What you doing? Well, you know, just getting it's getting a little chilly, so I'm kind of getting the, the diesel heater ready. Cool. Don't know if we'll need it, but if we do, it's ready to go. Better safe than sorry. Yeah. Now that's a fire. It's a good fire. Walking to town pouring with our little jerry can. <laughs> <laughs> good that's morning, tough. love. Good morning. How's it going? It's going well. Water's Egg. ready for um, coffee. Water's ready for coffee. Yeah. I'll get the grounds going and we're going to make some breakfast today. Yes. And so as soon as we get the coffee dripping. Actually, I can do it. Where are those little things? They're, they're I, in this one. Yeah, see, I don't even know what's going on. I'll, I'll get on it. I just wanted to say good morning and let the people know what's happening today because we didn't do much yesterday. No, so we got here yesterday and we essentially set up and relaxed, I guess. And how um, relaxing it truly was. What's that? And it was so relaxing. Dude, dude, oh yeah, it was incredible. It was, it was so relaxing. much fun. It was just a very chill after you hung out in the hammock. I did. I'll hang out in the hammock again today, <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> and then, uh, so today though, it's going to be kind of cool. Is we're going to try to set up our screen, right? Yeah, projector right. and screen. Projector and screen. Hopefully we get enough. Uh, we are somewhere where we can get service. Yeah, that is what it is. <laughs> we had to be somewhere where Kayla could get here, so. Yeah, so the youngest and her uh, partner are coming up today to visit and have some turkey. Yep. For now, know. we'll get some breakfast going. Brand new pan. Should I wash this thing first? I don't know. Uh, well, it's too late now. <laughs> I think they suggest to, but yeah. Whatever. I'm sure we've had worse as children. We ate dirt. Which actually probably is I ate more than dirt. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Remember? I ate those nuts on the ground, got oh, worms. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. All right, bacon is cooked. Bacon is cooked. Looks really dry. We can really pump the pooch on that one. <laughs> now we're going to use our toaster. We've had this toaster since forever. Yep. Never actually used <laughs> no, it. Never have. <laughs> so stupid. And you know what's funny, as much camping as I've done as a kid, I've never even seen one of these being used. I've always had one of these, being a kid. So, toasting buns for breakfast sandwiches, right? Yep. This could be good. Oh, that's so cute. Now it just does its thing. You never, seriously, never had one of those? I've never, we never used one of those, no. I should shut my own. Look at I, that. Perfectly. Whoa, that's brilliant. Oh, yeah. There's They're awesome. two plates there, love. I'll grab one. It's okay. I'm just... I'm just going to throw the eggs on. Would you like me to grab cheese, or are you good without? I'm good without. Okay. Actually, I'm fine. Do you want mayo? That I would like mayo, yeah. Okay. When you're too lazy to grab a knife, because it's all tucked away, <laughs> sorry all you people are going to be like, food safe! <laughs> it's just us. <laughs> it's hilarious. I had to grab the camera when I saw you doing that. I don't think I've ever seen you do that in my life. I've literally never done this in my life. When's the last time we actually took time to make breakfast while we're camping? Well, usually on our holidays, we are rushing. E yeah, either so. get up to get home before traffic or... Yeah, that's a, the part that sucks about lizard in the lower mainland. You can't really, you don't have that luxury of time with traffic. Or we're getting up to get to the next destination. Yeah, and that's, that's the other thing, so. Is the egg gonna fit on there? <laughs> I'm hoping. <laughs> They look good. I'm hoping. They'll Those be are delicious. Perfectly cooked eggs. Careful, these ones are gonna burst Perfect. for sure. Oh, this new pan is so slippery. I'm actually. I'll hold that. You got that? I got that. Okay. And then I can tilt that and put that on now. I'll do the same for mine. Look at that. All right, so this is our view. Not too shabby. Beautiful, beautiful morning. And we had such a relaxing night yesterday. It's crazy how relaxed we got. Much needed, of course. 
and we had Adam and Cheyenne visit us, which was amazing. We always enjoy spending time with those two. Such an amazing couple, so much fun. This is stunning. And the youngest has arrived. I gotta say, we're attracting a lot of attention at this camp. Hello, youngest. <laughs> Say hello, YouTube. Hi. <laughs> you brought your chairs, right? No. You didn't? You didn't say to bring chairs. Dad said, I hope she's smart enough to remember her chairs. I'm like, of course she is. Why are you bring chairs? To sit? Well, we're putting the screen up over there. We're supposed to bring chairs? Apparently. Yeah. I was, <laughs> was this mentioned in the what should we bring text? Know. Come on, guys. The it jury's out here. So. Come on. <laughs> okay, so we are going to set up our projection screen. Take out the two pipe sets with attached quarter bins. So with the this quarter bins? Yes. Was our Christmas gift from Kalia and Alexander last December. And then open them up to form tripods. And unfortunately, we have yet to use it, so we thought, why not today when she is here to help set it up? Yep. Well, it doesn't like to come down though, I'll tell you How that. How did you do that? Oh, loosen this. Don't, there you go. Don't make the mistake I did. Yeah. Oh, oh. And then you adjust the height. So, yeah. Oh yeah, you can make it as high or as low as you want? Yeah. That's cool. Kind of neat. No, I definitely don't want to get it. Really That's why, I, you know, just look at it here. But I think, nope, it connects. It just goes on it. So you're right. I noticed these things on that other side. That's, that is massive. There, boom. It just clicks in. <laughs> That's a big screen, Kalia. I know. <laughs> it's actually relatively easy to set up earlier. Really. It is. That's why we got this one. That's why you got it. <laughs> and takedown will be easy. Is there like oh and then oh and then it goes down the side too? Oh wow! <laughs> that is so cool. So where'd you get the chairs? <laughs> down there, so it's camp. <laughs> Apparently, our children are intelligent. <laughs> Jury still out. <laughs> So guys, we know this may not be exciting to the masses, but to us it is. We don't get to see our kids as much as we used to, so anytime they stop by for some family bantering and a meal, we're totally stoked. We saw a golf have a rooftop Oh yeah, no, a lot. Oh yeah. Cars have them all Car camping's becoming huge. I'll tell you what, you will enjoy that more than you will a ground tent in a second, but there's definitely the price difference. Well, if it's a gift. <laughs> it's not going to be a gift. <laughs> Christmas is pretty sale. <laughs> it's also his birthday, so like you could just conjoin them. Yeah. And then I want a stocking for Christmas. Um, I gave him your stocking. He can fill it. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't I give you your stocking? Yeah. yeah. Do you have it still? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's easy Stocking. Not to get the no, you know what? <laughs> Stockings end up being more than the present. Yes. The present. Yeah. That's why with when all you guys, you were the last one to get one for the longest time. They really want to rip you off, but the other ones quit doing it because it's just them, their partners, and everything else. Like stockings got ridiculous. But as kids get older, you can't go to the dollar store anymore. Yeah, it's like being like. I'll make you a dollar store stocking. And stuff. <laughs> <laughs> See how much joy she got out of that? You can't even eat the candy from the dollar store, though. Take the good stash for a little. <laughs> good stash for just a while. Stock, just buy me juice boxes. You know how expensive those are? And juicy peach. Yeah. <laughs> so we're putting in turkey. Is it hot? A little bit. A little bit. We don't want it too hot anyways. 
Perfect. Thank you. And what do you got going on? Gravy. You doing gravy? Gravy. Nice. I don't even really like gravy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, they got a gravy. <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom, boom. It's toasty. It's not really boiling anything. I don't need that to be. I this? turned it down. The gravy you turned down? No, the water. Oh. I can do it. <laughs> you gotta do the other one. <laughs> then tin foil to keep it warm. Mm, yep, I can be doing it too. Look at me. <laughs> Look at me, I can stir gravy. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the I don't want to brag. That's what? dad's fork. All right, so then Jeez. we need two cups of water in here. For quoi? For mashed potatoes. For our instant potatoes. Keep it real, ladies and gentlemen. Have you done this before? Nope. Do I use the same fork? Sure. Is that all you do? And then you mix it and then let it stand for a minute. Really? Yeah. Sharp, you're spilling this. You know how this works? She read it. <laughs> oh. To evenly wet all the potatoes. Oh, look at that. It's already thickening. And then you let it stand. Covered or uncovered? Doesn't say. I don't think you can over. I'll be so, by this oh, point, wow. you might be wondering, Joanne and Walt, like, why Thanksgiving from There's, a box? Oh, well, so typically, well, if we crazy. manage to get the whole family together, who are, okay. by the way, spread across two provinces, <laughs> oh, we will go the traditional route. But in more casual settings, we found that we want to enjoy our surroundings and each other's company more than spending the whole day cooking. So we're just waiting on the gravy and slicing the turkey. Yep. That's Which it. we could probably slice the turkey. Yep, I can do that I if think. you want. How's it look? Yeah, it looks good. It looks good. I think, I think so. It's steaming. Yep. Perfect. Rock paper scissors for who's gonna eat first? He's just being difficult. <laughs> yep. So what do I do? What's the plan with the third? Right, yeah, use your fingers. We're use all your fingers. We're family. We're all family here. Yeah. Beauty. And yeah. Oh, your salad. Oh, salad. I'll grab salad yeah. in a second. Pass it to me. And where is your little fork to here? Thank you. And Alexander's, I think this one was yep. yours. Okay, cool. Do you want salad, Kaylee, or come back for it? I might come back. I would have to say, it's a pretty successful dinner. I think so. Looks good to me. Ah. You're going to attempt. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I, I've never done Jiffy Pop either. Okay. It doesn't say to do it on, like it says to do it on a plate. Like you always got to move it though. Does it shake good? Oh my gosh! Alexander's got going on. Today's youth. What? They're tiny, but yeah, it's actually not bad. It's not terrible. Oh, careful! Not too much. Yeah. It's all falling out on this side. You did that? Not don't touch that! Don't touch that! It's not hot. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> And there it is. Has a taste. All right. Let's see if it's dark enough. Should be close. I would think. We got to catch up on all our peeps. We do. How much we've been able to accomplish? Uh, right now, we're just basically waiting. We're just pulled over, and we're airing down our tires to make it to the next destination. Over. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to the beautiful Adequai. All right, guys, that's it. That was our little Thanksgiving weekend getaway with family and friends. It was a freaking awesome time. It was so much fun. Uh, thanks to Adam for stopping by. Thanks to our beautiful daughter and her partner. And yeah, until next time, 
get out there, enjoy life, and find your moments. See ya.